Does your future look bleak? Debt collectors being a bane of your existence? And your old friend suddenly stopped recognizing you on the streets? Dude, I know the pain. That's why I chose to leave and start over. You want a fresh start without the debts, wanted notices, or arrest warrants? Isla Sombra is a place for you. However, this discreet little place has a few dangerous secrets. If you want to survive here, better listen to me now. First, the weather is awesome. The locals are friendly and moderately hardworking. They usually mind their own business, which is good for people like us. But besides the normal people, you will also meet a few more interesting individuals. If you're not afraid of some risk, they can show you an entire world of lucrative endeavors. You'll find them where people have a lot of fun, and the magic spell to summon them is the rustle of local currency. Speaking of currency, even in such a tropical haven, you need someone to keep an eye out for your goods. Some people who can count the money and not care about people's problems, an accountant. That guy is going to guide you through the intricates of billing with the patience of a chronic disease. Though not everyone will survive the process, well, death and taxes. The accountant knows everyone because he works for everyone. All those stuck up white collars, thugs with a collection of gold teeth, and fun loving starlets. Any of them can be your client. Isla Sombre also has a more homely side where no big politics take place. Life goes on slowly in an agreement with Mother Nature, true green lungs of the country. As an amateur gardener, I appreciate the work of these people. But if you want to experience some action, with a dash of mystery and a bit of danger. Try getting to Kira, a true specialist in connecting different communities. But oh wait, what communities am I talking about? There are a lot of dangerous people from all around the world hiding on the island. Some live together with the locals, but some are more hermit-like. If you earn their trust, you're going to find a whole enclaves of interesting cultures. Remember to respect their customs and do not question their culinary choices. They can be sensitive. If you've already decided to make home here, it's time to get some stuff. In the drug business, it's rather hard to get delivery orders. We do prefer DIY. Local craftsmen can help you get your business on a higher level. If you go sightseeing in Isla Sombra, you'll notice that its population is scattered rather unevenly. Some places are still wanting to be domesticated. Better tell your team you're taking a walk, just in case. Isla Sombre is a great place for retirement. It offers the possibility to pursue their passions using local ingredients. Our pensioners often a unique atmosphere and are a center of local society. If you get an invitation to one of their gatherings, don't refuse, it's rude. And are propos being rude? They're rotten apples, even in paradise. Here, we helicopter them to prison. Getting there means a break from everyday hassle, a break for many years. Of course, the situation behind the bars depends on a few factors, and they can even get an early release by donating to the social fund of the prison employees. Entrepreneurial inmates will make do.
how to move around in your new home by sea. At first, it'll be rather slow. Then it will be more stylish. In any case, the local marine specialist will help you choose the best boat and help avoid coral reefs and unnecessary Coast Guard patrols. Finally, you'll decide to visit the capital. Excellent idea! It's the apple of the eye of the nation's beloved leader. And yes, like every city, this one also has its problems. Well, unless until you run out of rent money and the city is addicting. The availability of individual and business clients, but they're compensated by the offer of cultural establishments. Who pulls the strings in the capital? The mayor, of course, appointed by the leader himself. He controls the apparatus of violence, the Department of Subjective Justice, and he conducts social consultations. Yes, Isla Sombra's capital has the face of its host. Despite their authorities trying hard to get to their citizens, some of them choose a life beyond the constraints of the tax system. It means limiting the prospects of growth ensured by bribes, as well as irregular access to public services. Luckily, the vacancy is filled by the chief of police, a true national hero. From rags to riches, this is the carousel of Isla Sombra. Some of the citizens were more lucky than others be it intelligence or decisiveness, or the connections to those in power and dirty tactics. Who knows? This is the golden rule. Do not ask the businesswoman about the source of her success. Ask what substances you can provide her with for the next party. Especially that every success requires sacrifice. Is La Sombra the best place on earth? Lately, it seems it won't be this long, as they say, paradise found. Is paradise lost? For years, Isla Sombra has been a safe haven for outlaws. Could it be that dark clouds gathering over it? Drug Dealer Simulator 2. We're going to start up our cartel right now. We got it uh, named right now, Sniff and Go. <laughs> but uh, we'll, uh, we'll see how this, uh, how this goes. And don't forget, guys, hit that like and subscribe button and that follow button over on Twitch. There we go. What's up, guys? Hello there. Oh, look at that. It's like perfectly cropped with the camera. <laughs> Unintentional. Just saying. I was looking at the soundtrack for this game by that guy. AP Tross. Friggin' solid. I've already listened to a couple Cypress Hill albums. <laughs> right? Oh, look at that. You guys are in the boat. Oh, let's go. A mighty fine yacht you got here. This ain't no yacht. Boys, I'm about to show you the empire of the drug business, all right? may know nothing about it, but we'll stumble through it. Man, in a way, Sombra. what a great place. I really miss it sometimes, you know. A lot of good <laughs> memories. Well, at least until it all went to hell. It's been a bit like watching game of... That looks uh, like a yacht over there. Never mind. I shouldn't say Let's it. Take it.
I'm a madman with the boat. Holy. Are we dealing drugs for Pablo right now? Well, I mean, who <laughs> leads me to believe that? <laughs> I have a phone. Oh, this is like. Fucking Nokia. Oh, looks like we gotta go up here. No, we can lie to her and be like, I don't have your cash. Yeah, we'll, we'll start. Is it just off base of one? I'm guessing it's base of one. Adios, amigo. Vuelve pronto. All right, special item obtained. Equipment package for Marcus. So remember when we do that, when we make decisions, it's for the whole group, not just one person. <coughs> Yeah. Huh? Alright. Yeah, it looks like we gotta go... All the way over there. Oh, nice. Nice parkour skills. There you go. Parkour. Parkour. The ocean wind in my hair and the sand beneath my feet. Life gonna get much better here. It's the fastest man alive. Sorry, yeah. you're not allowed to enter. Sorry, I'm gonna ask you. To... Okay. <laughs> you guys are just make sure fast. <laughs> parkour. <laughs> parkour. 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 Parkour, 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 parkour. Oh, well, this is my underground bunker. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, look at this. Oh, it's our plants. Close the doors. You got that package for me, huh? Yes. Yeah, here's the package. We have obtained one cannabis indica, 20 plastic baggies. Let's go. One, one indica? That's like a whole bunch right there. <laughs> one unit of indica? <laughs> I would like one indica, please. Oh, this is... This is like... Laboratory tray. Not... <laughs> Packaging drugs or substance. Drop items here. Oh, we have beds. Guys, we have beds. I don't think this is our place. Just saying. I mean, there's, three, there's three beds here, though. Yeah, no, oh, like really? Map in Could be our... I think you have to do it, Cosmic, because you got the drugs. I didn't sleep here. Oh, I have the drugs? Yeah, you have the drugs. Oh, that's what you, uh, you have it's pointing fingers it already. It says you have 100 grams of cannabis and okay. 20 plastic Look, bags on, on the yeah, lab tray. It, it you can unpack you substances from items gotcha. as well as create packages of your own. Look at all first this stuff. I gotta close all these things. Unpack hints. that drug package to add the dope. Do you really to the need all this storage. to weigh up some weed and put it in a plastic baggie? No. Are we gonna do yeah, it anyway? Cool. Yes. Now you need to create I mean, smaller packages of weed for those who decline. <laughs> Add new packages using the scale, plus side button and choose It's a really big scale point. with a really small plate. Like, what the fuck are you weighing? Real. <laughs> Cocaine. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Mm -hmm. Hey, you handled these sales, right? Nope. I want to talk to you. Uh, oh, whoa. I haven't sold anything yet. Oh, no, I talked to him. The lat, the lat hit you really nice in this room. Whoa. So you come to this bunker often? You see me doing this? <laughs> lean. Okay. Prepare drug packages. I'm working on it. You guys, are, you guys are yapping. I'm trying to listen to what the guy was telling me to do. Uh, all right. Uh, so we're doing, we're doing, <laughs> we're doing five grams of <laughs> marijuana to Palo Reyes. Small Island, three grams to Marco Lopez and two grams to Vivian Perez. Make sure to bring the right amount then in case we get, you know. Yes, yeah, so how it works is you have to individually pack everything. It's like, 
you know, how they would expect you to do it in real life. It's like, oh yeah, there's, I'm going to give yeah. you this bag, it has 20 grams out of it. Can you take like 10 grams out of it and give it back to me? <laughs> so you think I should package up any others? Should I do some like one grams or? Oh, you think we no, can just no. sell, like, you I'd think we can leave, leave it as it is for now. I mean, we have a ton. We still have like 90 grams. Because we might need it later. Or we might need it in bigger packages. Like, who knows? Okay. I'd say just leave it as is. So then, you know, if we can do street deals, we'll we'll do that later. Yeah, hold on. Let's see. Get this tutorial over, kind of. I can give you quest items. Give all your quest oh, items really? to this player. Yeah, it looks like all or nothing kind oh, of yeah. thing. So yeah, look. quest items. Cancel. Empty. Give money. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Why can you can only give all, but not to some? Yeah, it's kind of weird. Ooh, got a lean. You and E. You also have like yeah, an inventory. Yeah, no one else can see it though. And the hey, key, Nathan. Like, you uh, Fourth of July was good, man. Fourth of July was good. Can't complain. Okay. All right. So it says like we should have. Yeah. Roll out, sniff and go. Sniff and go, just about. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. I was like, I'm surprised he didn't. I'm surprised he didn't die. <laughs> just parachuted down real quick. <laughs> parkour. Without a parachute. I'm <laughs> parkour. <laughs> My guy's grunting. Heck yeah. Freedom foods. Hi guys. <laughs> this is really cool. It looks really good. Yeah, you reckon it's back here? I really want to buy my drugs. I just all walk up to you this guy. You want to buy drugs up here, fella? Oh no. You want to buy something? No? Okay. Oh yeah, there's a guy over here cleaning the window. Hey. Hey, young fella, cleaning the window. <laughs> I broke my legs, I swear. Oh yeah, because we're in the uh, the zone, right? So, around here somewhere. Who's this? Oh yeah, open trade. Vivian Perez. Hey, huh? Buy me some drugs. Uh, I don't remember how much to give her. Two grams. Um, Two? Great. Yeah. I was getting worried. Not, and here comes my present. Thank you, man. I hope you stay safe. She did. She just she freaking Thanos on us. What the heck? I'm lagging now. Okay, I'm fixed. Can like hold the ping around? Do you see this? Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. You just hold right click. You can like drag your name around. Yeah, I was watching the storm track on that Nathan and uh. Looks pretty gnarly. I call him. I call him. <laughs> At least some flooding for for mainland. Marco, how much are we giving him? To get harm. Hi, Marco. Just checking his watch. Time to get a uh, three. Don't invite Gunja. Doesn't deserve one. Ouch! Ouch! <laughs> I don't think I can do it. Can I? Maybe. Moon, journal about escape. We're just gonna be your wingman right now. Yeah, you guys are my friends to your game. Run the game. Join the naval. You guys are my muscle, all right? Yes, goodies. Yes, goodies. <laughs> oh, goodie. Okay, now Marcus's homies are one thing, but the rest of the clients later, they won't wait for you forever. Open the oh, yeah, phone look, to we, arrange meetings with other clients. Yeah, you don't have to do it immediately, but you know, the sooner the better. You can either set the yep. meeting ASAP or pick a convenient time for the delivery. But when the client's waiting for you, you better hurry. All right, good to know. Believe it or not, 99% of you guys aren't subscribed and watching these videos, so don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you want to see more content like this, and leave a comment down below.